WFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Del Rey Beach, Florida, with your 2 p.m. update. And currently, we have all the U.S. indices trade to the downside. Dow's off 300 points, 9 tenths of a percent. S&P, 4 tenths or 19 points. NASDAQ, 101 percent or 146 points. Russell's off 1 percent, 24. You've got gold trading up uh, 3 bucks. Uh, she's printing 1931. Silver's up 23 cents. That's 1 percent to the upside. 2532 is its print. Lights, we crewed up 6 percent, $6.46. 111.13 is the print natural gas up uh, three pennies trading out at 489. The 30 year treasury uh, down uh, two and two full points and 22.30 seconds trading out at 149.25. So let's go spend a little time, take a look at our uh, indice charts out here and give me a moment to change these uh, windows. Uh, in a moment, we'll see the Dow Jones Industrials in the upper left hand side. We'll see that today should become bar number seven. Looks to me like price wants to go ahead and target 35, 430 one level perhaps then it will form a td9 count top so we'll watch that uh, over the coming days that'd be tomorrow wednesday and thursday for that pattern unfold we will not have a similar pattern a simultaneous pattern uh forming uh, in the s p 500 it's only in bar number four but looks like it wants to target 45 26. the nasdaq 100 on friday actually closed above its td9 count breakdown level and that was at 14 342 we're below that today so we don't really have a confirmed breakout message but if we did get that that would suggest a move up to the next level next level 14 769. The Russell 2000 is in a sideways consolidation, even though it's not drawn in there. You can visually see that. If price were to break above the consolidation, that would get us up to 2210. The semis, bar number four today, pulling back. It's an inside bar. Uh, we really suggest that uh, price likely wants to add higher. And I don't think it'll get up to 3340. It could. That is the TD9 count breakdown level. The uh, How important are those breakdown levels? Well, if you take a look at the transports, Tremendous week last week. Where did the price stop? Right at that 16,618 area. The VIX index still looks like it wants to go approach the bottom of that Bollinger Band at 2206. And you got the XAU right now trained above its green oscillator and change line. If it closes above that, that's going to suggest that it wants to go test that TD9 count top, bar number eight out there in the 165 level. So, uh, folks, uh, stay tuned. Your favorite polar bear, David White's up next. After that, Tom O'Brien to take us on home. I'll be back with you tomorrow on Terrific Tuesday. Have a magnificent Monday, folks. Thanks again for joining us.